break. Ranger? Barbarian? Magician? Thief? Cavalier? And acrobat? Who was that? That was Venger, the force of evil. I am Dungeon Master, your guide in the realm of Dungeons and Dragons. Admit it, Hank, you don't have the faintest idea where we're going. Dungeon Master said we'd find a clue to help us get home in the forest with no trees. Dungeon Master's an airhead. How can you have a forest with no trees? Who knows what he really meant? That's it. You said the magic word, Presto. I did? It's not in O no, it's K N O W no. No trees. Trees that know. Oh, that's ridiculous. Trees don't know anything. I beg your pardon. Aww. Ah! Ah! Sounds like the young cavalier has met his first no tree. <laughs> Come, my young adventurers are in need of some assistance. <laughs> Dear me, buddy whoops. <laughs> I haven't done this in years. I'd almost forgotten how much fun this sort of thing can be. Your fun has ended, Dungeon Master. Of course I know the way out of this world. I'm a no-tree. I know everything there is to know. How do we know he knows? Ask me anything. Okay, who won the 1981 World Series? Simple, the Greywood Elves. The who? That thing doesn't know it's trunk from a hole in the ground. However, if you're referring to the 81 World Series in your world, it was the Dodgers over the Yankees, four games to two. Gosh, he really does know. If you're such a great know-it-all, how do we get out of this place? Oh dear, your friend, the Dungeon Master, is in great danger. Who cares? How do we get home? Dungeon Master in trouble? We've got to help him. Oh, brother. Hey, wait a minute. Take him to the caves. There's something moving up ahead. And up there, too. Look! Something tells me if these guys touch us, we'll get more than wards. Hello! We come in peace. A lot of good that's gonna do. It always works in the movies. So much for the movies. Time for some fireworks. Yuck! I hate frogs! Stay away from my sister, slime face! Hold this, fellas! Who are those guys? Who cares? Pull something out of that stupid hat of yours! Quick! What should I pull out? An army tank would be nice! Uh... Uh, Kerbuffin's a ruffin. Here goes nothing. Ew. Giant fly. Must have been something rotten in my hat. The only thing rotten around here is your magic. 
Rotten or not, Presto's magic may just save our necks. Come on! I think we lost him. And I think we lost ourselves, too. We've got to figure out how to find the Dungeon Master. Oh, what for? I say we forget about that little drip and try to buy our way home. With what? Fairy dust? No, money! You gotta be kidding. American money is useless in this world. Oh, yeah? We'll see about that. The first person I see, I'm gonna make an offer they can't refuse. <laughs> Some deal. What's he saying? How should I know? He's saying that those bullywugs took away the dungeon master and he knows where they went. How did you know that? I don't know. Give me a break. We're gonna listen to fairies now? We have no choice, Eric. Dungeon master may need our help. Lead on. <laughs> I have plenty of. What have you got? I've got a jewel for the crown of your master. <gasps> is he? No. The red glow indicates a life force is still with him. Tell Venture that Dungeon Master is his for the right price. Now go. Very soon, Dungeon Master. You shall be worth ten times the trouble it took to capture you. Are you just sure he said this is the way to Dungeon Master? Sure, I'm sure. I think. Say, uh, how, how far down is it, Presto? I don't know. I haven't looked. Well? Uh, nothing to worry about, Eric. If we fall, we won't hit the bottom. Oh, good. Because there isn't one. We'll have to turn back. Wait a minute. We can't give up yet. What would Dungeon Master do in a situation like this? Huh. Disappear. He says all we have to do is fly to the other side. In case he hadn't noticed, we don't have wings. No, but maybe Presto can conjure up some. Gee, I don't think so, Sheila. Lately, my hocus pocus has been out of focus. Give it a try, Presto. You can do it. Okay. Abracum, dabracum. Whoa! Nice trick. Hey, look! My hat's coming back. That's not all that's coming back. Ah. Take cover. Cover? What cover? Hey! Bobby! I knew we shouldn't listen to that fairy. They're gonna drop us. I don't believe it. They're friendly. Dungeon Master, close. He says Dungeon Master isn't far. Let's go. In there. Dungeon Master, in there. You sure he's in there? That cave looks like it's alive. Ew. And something tells me it doesn't brush between meals. We owe it to Dungeon Master to go in there and help him. Wrong. I don't owe that little runt a thing. No way I'm going in there. I'm finding my own way out of this nightmare. Oh, Eric, wait! Don't worry, if I find a way home, I'll send help. The Marines. I hope we don't regret this. I regret it already. I don't know. It felt like the walls were moving. Maybe it's friendly. Maybe not. <laughs> Presto! 
Presto, see if you can whip up a spell that'll stop that thing. Come on, Dad. Abracum, Zabracum. Oh, sorry. Dead end. I think this is it, guys. We won't give up that easily. Hey, Stone Face! Sheila, no! You guys run for it! This way. Hey, lose something, Boulder Breath? Oh, I've got to go back and help Sheila. It's too late for that. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm sorry it stopped me. Hey, let me go, Bacon Face. What do you want with us? I want to welcome you. Did you hear that? He wants to welcome us. For a minute there, I thought we were in trouble. Where exactly are you welcoming us to? To the slave mines of Daramore. Where else? We're in trouble. <gasps> aren't as bad as they look. There must be someone around this mud pit that can help me. There's someone! But, uh, excuse me! I wonder if you... Yes. Dungeon Master. Unlikely. I saw him. You saw him? Warduk says Dungeon Master is yours for the right price. The right price? Warduk has either become very brave or very stupid. However, I've waited many years for Dungeon Master to make this mistake. I will see to it that it's his last. Master's wrinkly little face right now. Say, Dungeon Master, did you? Uh, yeah. You know him? Know him, I don't. Know where he is, I do. You gotta tell us. Yeah, he'll rescue us. Rescue you, he will not. Unless him you rescue first. But how? Tell you I will. But promise me first, 
My people, you will free. Sure, sure. You got a deal. Now, where is he? On the other side of this wall, he is. Ah, it'll take us 200 years to dig through that. Not with our weapons. Yeah, but how do we get him away from those slobs? <laughs> Anyone? Well, I'd pay a thousand dollars for a taxi cab right now. has left him, and for you, the game is over. I didn't mean to step in your nest, honest! Give me those weapons. Now! Okay, we're giving, we're giving. You left us. Me? You kidding? I wouldn't leave you guys behind. Don't let them get away! <laughs> Looking for me? Try something. Anything. Right. Oh, Menace, come here. I hope this spell gets us out of here. <laughs> yeah. Prepare to meet your doom, young one. Not without a fight. Good morning. Dungeon Master. He's alive. I wonder if he's got a riddle that covers this. Your life force is stronger than I suspected, old one. As it should be. But not strong enough. Dungeon Master, look out! Evil energy is like evil thoughts. Change its direction and it changes to good. Your power has grown weak and feeble, old man. Harry, he will regain his form in a short time. Wait, I almost forgot about freeing the dwarves. Come on! Quick 
quickly. We have no time to waste. Dungeon Master, look! <laughs> oh my! There's too many of them! You'll never stop all of them! Not to worry, you won't have to. Unless he wanted them to. <laughs> How come you don't use your power all the time? Yeah, like to get us out of here. The answer does not rest within one's power. It rests within oneself. Oh, brother, that's deep. 